Welcome. Welcome to Tuesdays with Suzanne. This is our final in the series um, that we're working with around what's yours to do, practices for, for when things are challenging, to release things from your body, practices to work with. Last week we talked about practices to work with that are larger, larger scope in your world, things that you want to commit to and come back to again and again. Today I want to work with the process of recognizing that deep connection in our world, energetically, physically, spiritually, is one of the pivotal pieces of, of life force that feeds our souls that deep level of connection. A deep level of connection to ourselves and a deep level of connection to the world around us, to others in our world. Okay. So, if you would, let your eyes close, settling back, feeling your backbone as you breathe in and out. Settling in your heart. You may even want to put your hands on your heart. We were working with this, gosh, three weeks ago, four weeks ago, in what is ours to do. But feeling your heart. Breathing into your heart. Breathing all the way into the back of your heart, side to side, all the way into the front of your heart, deep into the bottom of your heart and the top of your heart, your entire heart, cushioned and cradled and hugged by your lungs. Bringing your awareness here with each breath. Breathing into your heart the thought, I am enough. You are enough. You are enough. But saying to yourself, I'm, I'm enough. Yeah. I'm more than enough. And I'm bringing this forward because often our inner critics will gnaw away at that sense of being enough. will make us anxious that we're not doing enough, that we're in the wrong place, that if something is challenging, it must mean we've done something wrong. No, no, no. You are enough. I am enough. Yeah. Breathing right on into that until your whole heart and your chest and your lungs are drenched in that feeling of, I am enough. I am enough. Yeah. Right on down into your belly, breathing into your belly and your backbone. I am enough. Deep into your pelvis. Yeah. I am enough. And you may be noticing if your hands are holding your heart, that your hands and your arms are feeling I'm enough because of the connection to your heart and your lungs. And that your neck and your cranium, all the way up and out the crown of your head, is starting to feel, oh. Oh, we are enough. Yeah, I am enough.
and breathing right down into your legs, into your feet, down into the earth. I am enough. And then as you breathe in and breathe out, I am enough. You may begin to notice that you're connected. You're connected through the earth. You're connected through the ethers. To a whole circle of people all over the globe that are working to be a rich, deep oasis of love for the people around them the caregivers, the people fighting for freedom, the people who care about others. And all of us are breathing, I am enough. We are enough. And it can give you, when you say that, a sense of connection outside of yourself that is everywhere. Connection to the trees, to the earth, to the air, to the water around you. We are enough. Good. 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 Mm. Good. Hmm. And feeling this, we are enough. Breathing it in and breathing it out. And feeling that sense of connection growing. Growing to the earth beneath you, to the air around you, to the people who are also committed as you are to love, to respect and kindness. feeling that connection, that deep connection to everything. And noticing how that lands in your body. I'm noticing I feel a bit like a homing beacon connected to many, many other beacons of light. And take as long as you want to to breathe with this and work with it. And enjoy.